Welcome to Obkyo's app. In this video, we'll be exploring the Application Performance tab within the app. You can use the Application Performance tab to monitor performance from an application perspective. More specifically, to test any website or web application from an HTTP or HTTPS point of view. This tab shows you the list of Application Performance Monitoring, or APM, tests in progress. Currently, there are two tests in progress. These two tests are created by the default configuration that comes with all new Obkyo accounts. The first test is called Google, and the second test is called Teams. Both tests are executed with the same monitoring agent, called MyAgent. To see more details about a specific test, just click on it. You can see the name of the test, the URL being tested, and the monitoring agent performing the test. You can then see two graphs the HTTP duration graph, and the download speed graph. The HTTP duration graph shows you the amount of time spent on each phase of this HTTP request, which means the time between the DNS, TCP, SSL, wait, and download steps. You'll also get the status code that was received from the URL. Then you'll see the download speed graph, which shows you the speed at which we downloaded the files. Because we do in fact download files when visiting a www.com URL. So here we see the download speed of all the files that were required. You can then choose another test. This other test was created towards teams.microsoft.com. This test is also part of the default configuration for new Obkyo accounts. As you can see here, there is no download speed. This is because the site in question redirects us to another URL. Go back to the start by clicking on the Application Performance tab to see your initial list of tests. You can then click on the gear icon to access your application monitoring templates. You'll see the two templates configured by default. Let's take a look. The first example is called Google HTTP. Here we have the name of the template called Google and we have the monitoring agents that executed this application performance test. If you click on it, you can see that it includes all the monitoring agents in the group My Agents. The frequency of the test is currently set at once per minute. Finally, there is the URL that is being tested, https colon slash slash www.google.com. Note that this URL can be changed. It doesn't need to be a URL. It can be, for example, a website like this. It doesn't even need to be resolvable in DNS. There is also no limit of the number of application monitoring templates. You can create as many as you like. To add a new template, navigate to the plus icon at the top of the page. Then choose the type of test, either HTTP or web. Web tests are available for enterprise plan customers only. We'll create a new template and call it Zoom. Then you can choose a group of monitoring agents to execute the tests. I'll just choose one specific monitoring agent for demonstration purposes. For frequency, we'll leave it to one minute. And we'll enter a URL to test zoom.us, then click Save. So we've now created a new test called Zoom. If you click once again on the Application Performance tab, you'll see the new test Zoom which was performed using the My Agent monitoring agent. From here, you can click on any APM test to modify or delete it. For example, I can delete the test that we just created by clicking Delete in this window. Then go back to the Application Performance tab to confirm that the test was successfully deleted. The Application Performance graphs are also available in the dashboards to help you analyze your data in a streamlined way. And there you have it. These are the features available to you in the Application Performance tab. We hope this video helped you learn more about Obkyo's app. Thank you, and until next time.